Alright, welcome to today's vlog. Actually, if I can better say this week's vlog. It's been a while since I did one of these vlogs. Although I say it's been a while, but it's only been like, what, a week and a half, two weeks. And that is because, as you guys may or may not know, I've said it in some videos, I've been sick the past week and a half. So it hasn't really been much content for me to vlog outside of the crib. So without further ado, we're not going to talk too much. My dad is picking me up today. It's the 16th, 12th of 2021. In about nine days, Christmas is due. It's kind of crazy if you think about it. So I'm getting picked up in about an hour, hour and a half because I did tell my dad I've got two videos currently processing and I don't want and I just want them to be done. So I'm going to Dylan tomorrow, tomorrow's Friday, and I'm gonna stay till Sunday and then Sunday night I shall be back at my place and we're gonna record a couple of videos again. So definitely stay tuned and I'm very excited for this week. I might record in the public transportation. It really all kind of depends on how busy it is because I don't really like people looking at me while I record. I'm still a little bit shy I suppose, but anyways, let's get this video started and let's go uh, at my parents' house today is a new day today is friday it is about one o'clock in the afternoon my mom and grandmother are currently shopping doing some stuff don't know what they're doing exactly my little sister's at school or i don't know kind of like daycare and um i'm going to dylan just now in the hague um probably leaving around 4 4 30 uh one hour an hour and a half so it should be there around 5 36 o'clock hopefully if everything goes according to plan but i am actually fun fact i am currently home alone and it's delicious i got the dog on there i got bella somewhere around there there you go that's pretty chill and i've got the christmas tree and everything set up so i might as well show you a little bit the house has been rearranged i mean you can check right here you know the christmas tree fucking hate christmas turn off the light because it's a waste of electricity but i'm gonna walk the dogs just now and I'm gonna try and see if I can shoot some footage on the metro and on the bus, depending on the busyness. Um, because you know, I'm not sure if it's allowed to. Oh, yeah, you definitely are allowed to record, but it's more that I just find it a little bit awkward. It is pretty good weather, as you can see, not too bad, not too shabby. So, I'll see you either on the bus or metro, or whatever. Oh, hey there, I have arrived in the Hague. It is eight o'clock, 17 12 2021. Tomorrow, my brother's gonna come over, we're gonna go buy some stuff for Christmas and some other stuff. You know, vlog a little bit in the hay like I did last time. My brother comes in basically every time I'm here. Very interesting. I actually just finished recording a marketing video, but when this video is posted, the video has been posted a couple of days ago, and I want to show you something. Right, this is something. All right, mind the farts. I'm sorry, I got a farty stomach. See the difference, right? Look at that, bam. No plastic lids. Interesting, but still very hypocritical because it still has plastic in it. So paper, cotton, I don't know, very nice, but you can see the lip in there. So I think what I'm gonna do is uh, I'll vlog a little bit more tomorrow because I'm getting a little bit tired. I wanna edit this mug thing as well because I have some stuff to do. Well, not that much. This weekend is, well, also gonna be recording. Tomorrow, me and Dylan are also gonna go to the store trying to find some Pokemon cards because I've been dying to find some fucking Pokemon cards. I swear to God. And if I go to a store, they don't have them. I'm like, fuck, man. On your website, it says you got them. And then if I come here, you don't. Make up your fucking mind, people. I want Pokemon cards. I want to do an unboxing video on this channel. And I, I, I don't even care about the money. Dude, I just want to box, a, a booster box or something. I actually had one for my birthday years ago. I think the black and white. Uh, 2014, 2015. Dude, it was like 140 bucks. But I got so many rare cards and like holograms and... That was probably one of the best books to box ever to legitimately get, legitimately get like these crazy pools. But I'm going to edit this mukbang for you guys. And um, yeah, I'll check you out tomorrow when my brother comes. We're going to go vlog a little bit in the car and do some other stuff. So see you tomorrow morning. Okay, so I know what you're probably wondering. Why are you in the bathroom? Um, yeah, I'm taking a leak by the way right now. But it is currently, I don't know, something 11.30 at night time I'm peeing. I got my pee pee in my hands. I'm going to flush the toilet. Give me one second. So yes, confirmation. My brother is coming over tomorrow, which is awesome so we're gonna go do some shopping do some other stuff might take the camera with or not i didn't take my bag with ugh nasty anyways um yeah i'm gonna end it i think i'm gonna go to bed or just chill to some music but i'm a bit tired so uh yeah i'll check out tomorrow morning man hey good morning i uh woke up about 20 25 minutes ago and the time is currently sorry let me just check very unprofessional for this for me 10 55 and it is the 18th today saturday my brother's coming over in about an hour, three hours, and you've probably got no clue what we're going to do. Um, yeah, we're just going to go to the shops and see what they've got here in The Hague. And um, as weird as it might sound, uh, a lot of y'all been asking for a Mary Jane video. So I want to try and see if I can find some Mary Jane for a video. 
um, maybe if they have maybe they don't got it well, obviously they got like those things in the Netherlands uh, which interesting fact I got a video coming up cannabis uh, it's actually not legal but it's sort of they've decriminalized the possession of cannabis here but even sometimes you get caught with it you can get a fine but yeah you hardly happens if you got more than five grams you're definitely screwed but I have a very massive headache I actually slept well bizarre enough you know you would consider and, and assume you know you live in the city that it's fucking busy this is actually very quiet considering this is the Hague uh, the Hague is a pretty big city you know it's a lot of fucking noise and a lot of apartments I've actually yet to really see a normal house that isn't attached or it's an apartment but yeah no great I uh, I think I went to bed at like 2 2 30 so I woke up like just 20 minutes ago or something so that's very nice perfect day and uh, I think we should definitely get our breakfast down the way I bought some stuff yesterday all right I actually haven't bought anything for my parents like Christmas wise so I want to try and see if I can get some stuff I'm also if that still is going to go through because I don't know if it's open on Sunday well maybe it is but I'm just considering like Dylan doesn't like to do fuck all on Sunday neither do I, I just want to chill out uh, he, they, he was gaming last night he was playing Russell with my brother Cal so that's very, very cool but my brother's coming over later so we're gonna vlog that um, Hopefully me and Dylan also after that are gonna go to the end of toy because I want to check if they got some Pokemon cards Which I'm pretty sure we do you promised me but you know change good plan, but yeah, let's see what we're gonna have for breakfast All right, so we are in the car right now my brother Cal behind the steering wheel Let's hope we don't get hit by no fucking car. We're gonna go do some shopping and I want to do some other stuff Woo! That sounds pretty good four cylinder. Hey, it's a two liter right 1.4 1.4 liter turbo, four, three or four cylinder? 500 cylinder. What you doing, crazy bitch? <laughs> so we're gonna go to the 6, shop. 6,000 cylinder. 6,000. That's what I would like to see. <laughs> fucking weird. So I'm going home tomorrow. Today is Saturday. It's a new day. It's a new time. Uh, I'm going home tomorrow around 4 ish. I'll probably be home 5 30, 6 o'clock. It's like an hour and a, it's like a hour and a half traveling, which ain't too bad, I suppose. So I will. See you guys just now with whatever we pick up exclusive documents i cannot disclaim or disclose what we're going to pick up uh yeah well you know what it is i already said it this morning man. um he is playing some music right now so i hope we don't get copyrighted but it is what it is this is the hague for those wondering this is what sort of parts of the hague look like um yeah it's pretty chill i suppose it's not the most prettiest city if i would say so but it's better than nothing man some people don't complain some people appreciate what they have so uh, I will check yeah, out just now. Alright, so we just came back and uh, look at my eyes. Yes, I'm very chilled out. Um, it's actually not too bad. The hay compared to like where I live, it's interesting seeing all the different multicultural people and like fucking you know, religions. It, it is nice to see like where I live right now, it's very one sided. So there's only 99% of the people that you know live there are Caucasian, they're white. And some of you might say, what does that got to mean? It's just interesting to see a difference when, you know, moving in Rotterdam and then fucking moving out of Rotterdam. The differences in cultures, the type of people and everything. It's interesting to see. Um, it's nice, but also like, fuck, man, I just miss the Turkish food and like all the other stuff that like multicultural places offer and have to offer, you know, for everyone else. It's like the food and everything is just, is amazing. So that's one thing I absolutely fucking love about The Hague is the fact you got like, Turkish, Polish, Arabian, you name it they got it all and that's what makes it so nice as well like the hague you guys know me i don't really like cities that much but the hague is one of those places i'm like i like it because of everything they even have a taco mundo so i might go ahead and mess around and order some taco mundo if it's on uber eats later because i want to definitely make a mukbang and see if they got anything vegetarian let me ask my cousin if they do all right, so I just ordered something for uh, a mukbang Monday. I'm not sure like when this vlog is going to be posted. Probably only on the Tuesday. I just ordered taco Monday. Now I've never, and I swear to God, I've never had that. I, I ordered a veggie taco, a veggie burrito, veggie quesadilla with a Jerritos drink in it. Uh, about 20 bucks. That actually ain't too bad. I have had a burrito, but I haven't had it in a while because I feel like when it comes to burritos, it's really difficult to make them. As someone who's very passionate and loves, you know, cooking, uh, burrito is one of those things I unfortunately cannot make. So, a Mexican mukbang? Sort of half Mexican, maybe not? I don't know if the people actually work in that or Mexican, authentic Mexican, but it's Mexican. 
and we don't have a taco bell here uh, i would have loved to try taco bell but taco monday is something i've wanted to try for del monte i think it's called but wanted to try it for a while so we're gonna try that out and uh i'll let you know after this uh, video if it's good or not i'll give my honest opinion about it so i'm very very excited if it's going to be worth the money and the experience all right so uh, i just finished the taco monday and uh my god it was honestly fucking insane the food I don't know what it was bro, but it was something about the food that I was like, oh my freaking god. I'm actually currently pro uh, uploading this video, I edited it, it actually, uh, I edited it, yeah sorry. It's actually very cool, Um, so tomorrow, we didn't actually have plans today to go to the end of because I was going to see if I could buy some Pokemon cards. Though it's interesting because when I went to Intertoys about a month ago, you know, my dad's work office where we went to the Intertoys because I saw on their website that they had Pokemon cards. I was like, oh yeah, let me go check out if they actually have them in store, right? So we walk in the store, no, they don't have them available. I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? It says on your garden website that you have them available. How are they not here? Well, even though uh, Pokemon, uh, I'm pretty sure the creator of Pokemon is, is dead or I don't know, something, I don't know. But it's still a massive thing to this day, you know, people that say it's, you know, relevant. I don't know what the fuck you guys be talking about. Pokemon is not dead and it will never be dead. Initial plan is for tomorrow to go to the Indie Toys and try and see if they got Pokemon cards. If Dylan doesn't wonder, you know, depending on how late he wakes up, because he does wake up pretty late. I kind of want to move around three, four-ish here, because it's an hour and a half to one hour, 30 minutes to travel to my place and i just don't want to be here at night time in the hague with all due respect the hague rather damn no thank you i don't feel really comfortable here at night time and yes i'm a guy in this case not a female which is a uh, important thing if you're female uh, don't go outside alone in rather damn the hague after 10 11 o'clock just speak well i'm not speaking from experience i'm just like just don't it ain't the best advice i can give you but if not then i'll just fucking you know go to the intertoys tomorrow myself before i leave but we I don't know, we arranged it, but yeah, man, I hope y'all were liking the content, I hope y'all were liking these vlogs, I, uh, like I said, sorry for like last week, two weeks ago, not an actual vlogs, you know, I was sick, and I'm actually quite tired tonight, I, it is only, it's the 18th, 12th, 2021, Dylan is coming over at my place next week, Friday, which is pretty, pretty chill, so you're definitely stay tuned for that, and yeah, what else can I say? I'm gonna end the vlog here and I'll catch y'all tomorrow morning when I wake up. I don't know what time, hopefully not soon. Uh, the dog actually surprisingly has been very quiet lately, so <laughs> I'm very happy. I've only heard the dog bark a couple of times this morning. So yeah, can't complain. That was a loud bang. <laughs> Holy yeah, crap. To close this off. Playing some rust. With another random British person in it, bruv. <laughs> in it? <laughs> Look at that setup, dude. God damn. Some serious shit. It is 23.42 at night time. I am going to go to sleep because I'm uh, almost falling on the couch sleep. Yeah, tomorrow, well, I say tomorrow, like I said a couple hours ago, we're gonna go to the Indie Toys, but uh, that probably won't happen because we probably won't wake up early. Just brush my teeth. I actually just made a very interesting combination. I was taking a poop whilst brushing my teeth. How interesting, I don't think I've ever done a combination. Why am I sharing this information? Uh, I don't know, for my guys out there, or my females out there, pooping and uh, brushing at the same time. Saves water. So anyways, um, yeah, I'm a, I'm a <laughs> I check out tomorrow morning. <laughs> Good morning, I woke up about an hour ago. I am currently making some breakfast, so I might as well show you what I'm making. I, yeah, didn't sleep too bad, but didn't sleep too fantastic neither. So let me show you what your boy is cooking. It is plant-based fish. Yeah, very interesting, I know. This is what it looks like. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it before. I cooked this for a mukbang or I don't know, in a vlog or something. I have to probably put the thing up higher. That's a bit too high, Jesus. That should be good enough. Excellent. It is it's like 12 o'clock or something already, so Dylan hasn't woken up yet. We did say we were going to go to the store around 1-ish, 2-ish. really hope we do. 
Um, but I honestly don't know, man, if he's gonna wake up. And if he doesn't, well, then it's what it is, I suppose. No stress, no spongy. The apartment is quite nice. Um, yeah, people ask me, you know, do I live here? No, I don't fucking live here, thank God for that. And yeah, I wouldn't ever personally want to live in an apartment noise and i feel like noise is the biggest issue for me i like very quietness although i am a person who likes to make eruptive noises with music kind of hypocritical i know i'm very sorry about that but uh, no i don't like doors getting slammed and all the echo because it's super echoey this apartment holy crap it's ridiculous how echo it is but um yeah we're either gonna go to the store and i'll film a little bit or either me leaving because i'm not sure if he wants to do this still if he wakes up his ass better wake up just now because I want to go home really, really soon. And about two, two, three, I, want, I wanted to leave around three o'clock, so I'm hoping to leave around three. Uh, but yeah, I saw she just now. I'm gonna have my breakfast and watch a little bit YouTube slash Netflix, whatever there's available, because he saw this PlayStation a couple of weeks ago. All right, so I'm back home. I'm not even kidding, man. It took so fucking long to get it. It took me three hours to travel here because the thing to Sridham Central wasn't working. I'm like, fuck, you're kidding me right now. So I'm back home. It is five o'clock at night. Me and Dylan were actually supposed to go. Hey, I'm overdosing my consonant. Sorry. Uh, me and Dylan were supposed to go to the Indy Toys, but I was like, you know, it's one o'clock. It's fucking late already. And his ass ain't gonna uh, wake up sooner or later. So I'm back home. I actually just had dinner. I had some vegetarian so at the soup. I'm currently going to edit this video for you guys, but I hope y'all like the vlog. I actually have a sponsor coming up. Thank God I had to buy Wi-Fi just now because I wasn't connected to any Wi-Fi. Got a fucking tablet. Look at that, bro. Blackview again. Show massive shout out to Blackview. I'm gonna make a decent. Uh, well, I'm, actually, I might as well show you what's in the box. I'm gonna make a very nice sponsor for them. This is fucking dope, bro. As someone who doesn't like Android, this is dope. Look at that. <laughs> for free, and I got paid for it. So hell yeah. Definitely. Uh, I'm happy about it. You even got a adapter. Obviously, you need an adapter because how the hell are you gonna connect it to the stuff? We got a charging cable, which is fucking dope. We actually got two believe it or not. This is for like when you want to put movies on or something. This is for like a SIM code. I'm not sure if it will catch it. There you go. And then you got like the manuals. But um, dude, I'm really happy. I really did wish they gave me headphones in them, but can't complain. I got a free uh, tablet. So you know, really can't complain. I'm very glad about that. So fucking awesome. Shout out to Blackview. I'm gonna end this vlog for y'all here because I uh, just want to go chill. It is actually not super cold. It was cold when I arrived there, but you know, I got everything turned on. I just had to add my mom through my 4G and say, listen, I need Wi Fi because my fucking Wi Fi is stopped. So basically, on this park, you pay for the Wi Fi, which, yeah, I guess it's stupid. They actually did boost up the price of the park. They, instead of 26, they made it three grand now a year. Which is fucking ridiculous, obviously. I mean, if you if I'm paying more, then I should be getting some other stuff included. But it's what it is. You know, you're paying for their services, although they don't really do that much in my opinion. Fuck, you know. But anyways, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna, I'm gonna end this vlog for y'all. Uh, yeah, i have been thinking of doing a cannabis ASMR. I don't know. I got two joints here, by the way. Like two massive fat joints rolled up. Nice. I didn't roll them up, by the way, but. I'm gonna end the vlog here, man. I really wish I could vlog in the metro, but it was so fucking noisy in there with the sounds and like the metro going, so I wasn't really able to vlog any of them. You know, I'm not, it's not like I'm embarrassed. It's just like I don't like vlogging if it's so noisy and you can hardly hear my voice. So my foot hurt, my feet hurt. Actually, only my right foot hurt. We got some fucked up news. I uh, don't know if y'all know the West Coast artist LA, uh, Draco the Ruler, got stabbed to death uh, backstage at 8 30 p.m. Backstage, fucking crazy man. Uh, yeah, these rappers are getting murk left and right, man. It's crazy. Young Dolph last month, and now we got another artist. I ain't gonna front you, man. I didn't fuck with this music that heavy. I know, I know him as an artist, but it's not like I listen to each song. You know, I'm not a fan or something, but I knew a song or two of them. And uh, yeah, really nice, uh, chill flow, like really good shit. Just like I swear, Fezzo, pretty good artist as well, by the way. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna end this vlog here for y'all. And I got some interesting videos coming up. We're gonna be talking about plastic surgery. And also about school shootings that is occurring a lot. I want to say for quite a, quite a time in America. And school shootings don't appear here. It hasn't appeared in like 10 years. So thank you so much for watching. And I'll check you out in next week's new video. Next week i got a fucking awesome vlog hopefully coming up. It's Christmas time next week. So I'm really hoping I can make a good vlog. I got my Wi-Fi so that's great. So I can upload this video in time for y'all. So thank you all so much for watching. And I'll check you out in next week's vlog. New podcast tomorrow. Peace out.